First Presbyterian Church in Titusville was left in a shambles. The graffiti that was in here was actually up here on this wooden part. In January, someone broke in and damaged almost every room. The church is safe. With that, Sunday's offering was broken open. About $1,500 was stolen, along with personal information on people's checks. The repair bill was about $80,000. The worst part? An elderly congregation somehow feeling that it's not safe. Pastors we talked to say seven churches in Titusville have had similar break-ins. I think it's kind of epidemic. Police and church members have a pretty good idea of how to find the burglar. How do they know? His mother called and returned some of what was stolen. There's no way of knowing if it was the same person in every church, but there are similarities in some of the break-ins, such as satanic graffiti. If they pretty well know who, who was there, that they ought to be arrested. Police did not respond to our questions about their investigation. In Titusville, Dan Billow, WESH 2 News.